The current FIA Super License System has been criticized by numerous drivers in the sport. Lewis Hamilton believes that the FIA should change the regulations surrounding the Super License required to compete in F1 to include obligations for aspiring open-wheel racers to complete their education. The Super License System was introduced back in 2016 following the controversies surrounding Max Verstappen's promotion into F1. The Dutchman found his way onto the grid as a 17-year-old before he had even obtained his road driving license. And despite his impressive pace, some high-profile crashes raised concerns about his presence. In response, the FIA introduced the super license, requiring all F1 drivers to be 18 years of age or older, possess a road driving license, and accumulate 40 points over a three-year period from the series recognized by the sports governing body. This was a controversial move, and it remains a point of debate today, discussing the need for super license changes, Hamilton said. I recently heard that children in karting no longer go to school. That can't be good for the future. Proposing his changes, he added, to get the super license you have to stay in school and get an education. Over 99% of drivers don't make it to Formula One, maybe even more. The sport has to make sure that the children continue to have something to fall back on, Hamilton isn't the only driver who wants changes to the super license system. Former Marussia F1 driver and IndyCar stalwart Alexander Rossi criticized the system after the FI changed the rules earlier this year, allowing 17-year-olds to drive in the series if they have demonstrated outstanding ability and maturity in single-seater racing. This rule was tweaked to ensure that Kimi Ananelli could make the step into F1 before his 18th birthday in August if needed, although this was not required in the end with Williams opting to replace Logan Sargent with their own junior driver, Franco Colapinto.